Hey guys and track and welcome back to the channel. Today I'm going to be talking about why the new YouTube terms are terrible. I'm not going to cover really everything. I'm not that professional guy that you just want to like just decipher every bit of text. I kind of did really bad in English so you should expect me not to be that good. But I'm going to give it a shot. Firstly one of the rules is nudity. Honestly I'm okay with that. None of my videos have nudity in. I don't recall much YouTubers who actually use nudity in their videos. Maybe like boobs and stuff stuff like that, they're not allowed to be in the thumbnails. I sort of heard that this is only for thumbnails and not actual videos of themselves. I doubt the YouTube team would want to just watch thousands and thousands of videos uploaded every day to actually see if it's like going under the terms of use. So if you've got a title or thumbnail, you best behave. At least my titles and stuff aren't boobs and everything like that, so I can get views and stuff. Mine are actually accurate. So I should be good. Next is swearing is not allowed in your videos. Like, come on. Have you seen most of the YouTube community? They, they all swear. I mean me, I don't swear for my life, so that's good. But like, so many people are going to lose their flipping monetization because they swear too much. I mean, if they tried to like get monetized by censoring all swearing out, it would just be like this. Like literally, their content is going to go down the drain. If you can't stop swearing, that YouTube channel's gone, like seriously. I know a lot of people just survive off of YouTube. Like if they don't get paid on YouTube, they're gone. Like they'll have to like work somewhere. Actually, they would probably be able to easily find a job with their current YouTube stuff. Just all the skills they picked up off of YouTube. You'll probably be able to find a job with all these skills. Heck, even if my YouTube career doesn't go very well, which it isn't, but it's starting to pick up slowly and slowly but like I'll be able to get a job straight away like with all these skills I picked up. Next they decided that violence isn't allowed in YouTube videos. Like how ridiculous is that? Have you seen all these YouTubers like the COD community, Halo community, like any gamer ever? They're not going to be able to monetize their videos and get paid for doing that. Thirdly the most ridiculous thing ever, YouTubers decided that you can't have an opinion in videos. What? What? You can't make a video without an opinion. So you're just gonna shut everyone's channels down. You know me, I'll try my very best to follow as many rules as I can. Even with these rules active, I'm still gonna try my very best to stay on YouTube without actually breaking the rules. But this one, I can't upload a video without breaking this. It's like ridiculous. That like anything I say will be an opinion. Then again, those channels out there like Keemstar, Leafy's here, Nicole Arbor, they're, they're not gonna be able to upload. So that's a plus to that like they make money off just ruining people's lives and bullying people no one should be able to do that I'm actually quite worried that this this video is gonna be taken down just because it has an opinion in it's not gonna get taken down as much as I know it's gonna like I'm not gonna be able to monetize actually actually I just realized I don't earn nearly enough views or anything to actually be able to earn money so it's not gonna bother me that much honestly I think YouTube's gonna lose a lot of people from like YouTube Everyone's gonna just quit. YouTube's gonna like go really downhill unless they change these terms back. They're trying to change every content creator in someone like take like a Minecraft Let's Player for instance. I feel like YouTube's trying to turn everyone who does YouTube into Minecraft Let's Players who firstly don't swear, are kid friendly and stuff like that. There's so many different YouTubers out there that every category is filled like kid friendly, over 18 etc etc you can't just make every youtuber on youtube bide to like become kid friendly it's just not like that it doesn't work like that you know where you can just write and type differently i i use the mouse with my phone like the left thing you're meant to use your is this the index finger i, I don't know what this is there's so many things i didn't learn in school that like I, I may have been taught them but i forgot because i i just can't pay attention for flipping six hours straight moving back to what I was saying I guess what I'm trying to say is that YouTube's trying to tell me that what I'm doing is wrong and I should change what I'm doing to what they think I should be doing it doesn't work very well like you just you can't just get someone to like change the way they do things because they've got a whole thing planned out if you spend so long like a couple of years doing something one way someone to just decide oh hey up you can't be doing that because I said so at the end of the day I know a lot 
lot of YouTubers that would just straight up not even follow these rules. They'll probably even protest against this because this is something that's like taking their privileges over YouTube. Like if you're gonna try and take someone's privileges, they're gonna wanna fight back. Especially if they haven't done anything wrong. In my opinion, I don't necessarily like swearing, but it's dealable. It's a natural thing for the human to say. You can't just straight up say, oh, you can't upload to YouTube and earn money anymore because you swear and expect them to just completely stop swearing. Swearing can actually become a habit. Like me talking right now, I can just accidentally slip up and say a swear word, but I've taught myself not to swear over the last few years. Or my whole life, mainly. Yeah, yeah, it was my whole life. You don't know many people who spend their entire lives trying not to swear. A lot of you guys are probably going to be typing in the comments, oh, you got 100 subscribers. This isn't your problem. Well, in my defense, I will be having to deal with this in future if my channel does actually explode at some point. So I'd like to actually continue in a future that isn't going to completely endanger my videos. So hopefully YouTube doesn't really destroy my video for talking about this. If I do lose my entire channel from this one video then rip me but it can't really be helped. Anyway subscribe if you haven't already, leave a like. I hope you have a good day and I'll see you in the next video. Bye!